Hello, hello, intermediate class students from intermediate level. How are you doing? Where are my students? Where are you? Okay. Hi, hello, nice picture, nice picture. I love that picture. Hello, 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 Azucena Castro. What's up? I'm fine. Really? And you? Really? Super duper, you know? It's Thursday, tomorrow is Friday, it's weekend, right? Yes. We have no class tomorrow. Hmm? <laughs> Any plans for the weekend? Um, descansar, ¿cómo se dice descansar en inglés? R E S T. Rest. Rest. R E S T. Rest. Rest. You need to rest on the weekend? I rest this weekend. This My weekend. plan? My plans are rest in this weekend. That's a good plan. That's a good plan. What do you do, Azucena? Do you work or study? Uh, today? Today no, or? No, normally, in your general life, do you work? Uh, ambas? Both. Both. B O T H. Yes, B O T H, both. So you work, work. and you study also. Huh? Yes. Nice, nice, good. Well, let's get ready to um, keep learning. Let me say welcome in the meantime to Noah Pons. Hello, sir. How are you doing tonight? Uh, this, uh, I am reading for the uh, reading more the class to more bell. Nice All right, you. it's great. It's great to see you in the class. Welcome, Noah. And let me welcome also to Susanna, Caroline, Paula. Hello, Miss Susanna. How are you doing today? I'm fine, teacher. Yes, what's new? What's new with you? Mm. The morning. I visit my fa my father. Really? Yes. Where, where did you visit him? My father in Huayua. Oh, nice, nice. Is he good? Yes. Is he okay? It's okay. Very happy, I imagine, huh? Yes. <laughs> do you do you have brothers or sisters? <clears throat> no. You're an only child. Yes. Is it good? Is no it good? No brother, no sister. Is it good to be the only child? Yes. Good. Ah, okay. You have more attention. All the attention for you, huh? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> That's good, Miss. That's good. Happy to see you in the class. Let me also say welcome to Mercy Piera. Hello, Miss Piera. How are you doing today? Fine. Thank you. Good evening. Good evening. Good to see you around here. Do you have any plans for this weekend? No, I can rest it in my house because oh, I'm tired. You're tired. Yes. It's a weekly, it's a very tiring week. I know. Very absorbing, very occupied. It's important for you to get some time for you, right? Relax and chill. Yes. Okay. Let's say welcome also to Jaime Hernandez. Hernandez. Hello, Mr. Hernandez. What's going on? You look fresh. You look fresh. Yes, teacher. Very, very good. It's fresh the weather. The window. Hey, <laughs> you got the window right there. So you get the fresh air on your back. Natural yes. air. That's good, man. That's <laughs> good. You like to be comfortable in my class. That's good. But yesterday it was colder. Yesterday it was fresher. Today is a little bit different, right? Or in some places it's raining right now. Is it raining where you are right now, guys? 
No. No. I'm in, the, I'm in the capital. Are you in the capital? San Salvador? Oh, I'm in San yes. Salvador. Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Yeah, in the capital. Okay, yeah. Some people are saying that it's raining, so I don't really know. Anyways, let's say welcome also to the rest of the students. We have uh, Maria, Maria Siwansa. Is that you? Can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Great. Welcome to your class. Are you ready? How are you? What's new? Yes, I am ready. Oh, okay. Bye, teacher. Nice to see you again. It's nice to see you again, too. It's a pleasure to see you around. Let me Thank say welcome you. to Carla Marino. Hello, Ms. Carla. How are you doing today? Good evening. Um, I am great. You sound a little robotic. Can you hear me well? Yes. I don't know. I think I will. I have problems with the Wi Fi, I think. Yeah, I think so. You sound a little, a little weird, I would say. But hopefully, you can fix that later on. Um, let me say welcome also to Brian Ariel Hernandez. Hello, sir. How are you doing today? It's a start, already started to rain here. I can't talk. All right, Mr. Brian. I hope you can hear us and you can chat any type of participation tonight. Well, let's move on, ladies and gentlemen. We were talking about modal verbs, making um polite requests using module verbs. Let me share my screen with you once again so we can get started. Um, can you now visualize my screen? Yes. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right. So now that we're showing it, um, let's go over these ways to make a request. This is uh, the scenario is at a restaurant, right? Between the waiter and the customer. But there can be plenty of different scenarios, right? It can be in your work. It can be on your, um, on the gym or whatever, right? But being polite, it's part of it. So always suggest you to use would, always suggest you to use will, right? To make uh, requests. For example, what would you like? What would you like? What would you like? You need to use the most convenient way, right? You can say, I like, or you can say, I'll have whichever is better for you to pronounce, right? Okay. What kind of dressing would you like? Again, I like or I'll have. Take it into account. What would you like to drink? And at the end, you need to offer additional help. Would you like anything else? Would you like anything else? Let's suppose, let's imagine that we are in the restaurant, right? I'm taking the order, the restaurant order, okay? And you're going to order, right? Your food, your drink, your dressing, right? Anything like that. Just like if you're in a restaurant. Um, First question, what would you like? Imagine you're in the restaurant. What would you like? I'm taking notes. What would you like? Okay, sir. Okay, lady. What would you like to order tonight? Um, Jaime. Yes, teacher. What yes. would you like to order? I like... Uh, 
Japanese food. Okay, and you said I like, correct? I like. I like Japanese. Okay, Japanese dish. We're gonna get you some sushi. Okay. Yes. Uh, what about you, Noe? What would you like to order tonight? Activate your microphone for me, please. Thank you, Chan. Sorry. Uh, I would like soup the the chicken. A chicken soup? Yeah, chicken soup. I would like chicken soup. No problem. On the way. What about you, Miss Mercy? What would you like to order? I would like a, a fish, please. Fried fish is okay for you? Yes, it's okay. Nice, nice. Let me take note of it. Thank you so much. What about you, Miss Isa Ortiz? What would you like? Um, I will like um, Mexican food. Okay, a Mexican dish with a little spicy touch. Not a problem. Good answer, Isa. Good answer. What about you, Miss Maria Siguanza? What would you like? I will like a piece of cake. A piece of cake? So you're not really hungry for um, a main dish, but actually a dessert, huh? You're in the mood for a dessert. Not a problem. What about you, Miss Susana Carolina? Paula, what would you like? Okay, what about Carla Marino? What would you like? I uh, have a hamburger. A hamburger, okay, okay, okay. Would you like cheese on it? Yes. No problem, no problem. Okay. What about Mr. Juan Linares? What would you like to eat tonight? I would like lasagna. Okay, let me get you an Italian lasagna for you. And uh, what about Mr. Brian Ariel Hernandez? What would you like to order tonight? Okay, what about Mr. Jaime Reyes? What would you like to order tonight? Uh, I like the... <laughs> pizza okay we'll get you some pizza not a problem good job guys if you notice if you notice most of you use i like i would like and that's okay that's perfect okay like one or two students use the other way i'll have but it's perfect it's perfect uh what about drink what would you like to drink what would you like to drink uh, Ms. mercy I would like uh, uh, soda, please. A soda, okay. On the way. What about you, Mr. Noah? What would you like to drink? I would you like to drink coffee, teacher? I would like to drink. Repeat, I would like to drink. I would like to drink coffee. Not a problem. With one sugar spoon or two sugar spoons? Uh, one. One sugar spoon. One sugar spoon. No problem. What about you, Jamie Hernandez? What would you like to drink, sir? We have beers, we have alcoholic beverages, uh, we have tequila and coffee, so on. I I like a cup of coffee. <laughs> oh, you already have it. All right. <laughs> I like, I like. Okay, Jaime is using the contraction of I would. I like. Then I like. That's I'd perfect. Like. Good yes, job, I Jamie. Can. Yes? Thank you. Thank you. Susana, go ahead. Um, I would like tea. A tea? Yes. Okay. Would you like herbal tea? I would like tea de manzanilla. Apple tea, okay. You would like apple. apple tea, not a problem. What would you like to drink, Hector? What about you? Nope. 
Okay. What about you, Juan Linares? What would you like to drink? I would like lemonade. I would like to drink, repeat, I would like to drink a lemonade. I would like to drink a lemonade. Excellent. That's a complete request and very formal. Look at the last question. Would you like anything else? Repeat. Would you like anything else? Would you like anything else? Would you like anything else? Anything else? Anything else? If like it's affirmative, you say, yes, please. I like uh, some water. Yes, please. I like two or three more tortillas, right? Or if it's no, negative, you say, no, thank you. That'll be all. Repeat, that'll be all. That'll be all. That'll, that'll, be, that'll be all. That'll be all. Thanks. That'll be all. That'll be all. Eso sería todo, right? All right. Would you like anything right. else? Would you like anything else, uh, Gilma? Would you like anything else, Mercy? Yes, I like dessert. All right, no problem. Yes. Let me get it for you. A okay. Dessert, please, I, 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 what ice do you cream. say, teacher sorbete? I don't ice remember. Cream. I like. Yes, ice cream. ice cream. Yes. All right. Yes, we have chocolate. We have mint. We have a strawberry and vanilla. Uh, chocolate, please. Chocolate. <laughs> chocolate. Chocolate. Um, chocolate. Would you like anything else, uh, Mr. Juan Linares? No, thank you. That'll be all. That'll be all. Excellent. Would you like anything else, Miss Castro? Yes, please. I would like some caramel flowers, please. Okay. On the way, on the way. All right. Miss Maria Siguenza, would you like anything else? Anything else? Yes, please. I like uh, salad fruit. A fruit salad. Huh? Salad. Fruit Ooh, salad. Yummy, yummy. Yes. Okay. Your fruit salad is on the way. Thank you. What about Miss Gilma? Would you like anything else? Yes, please. I'd like um, a soup. A soup? Okay. We have the beef bone soup or specialty, and we also have tortilla soup. Lo último no lo entendí. Tortilla, tortilla soup. Tortilla soup. Please. Oh, that's a good choice. Not a problem. Good job, guys. Good job. Excellent. 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 Any question about this topic? Any question about this so far? We can move on, right? Excellent. Let's move on. This is your knowledge check and let's go to the next objective. All right. This is listening. You have to do. You gotta go through. And we're going to move to our next objective, really. Let me see. My system is working a little slow right now for some reason. Let's see, put the words in order. No, this is yours. This is your homework, right? Let me see. One second. Let me see. Mm, give me one second, guys. I think this uh, platform lapsed for me. So we're going to 
Wait a second, let me load it. Technical issues, ladies and gentlemen. Don't get nervous, don't panic. So in the meantime, here. Maybe because it's the internet connection. Okay. So let me expedite this a little bit and I'm gonna share once again. I'm sorry guys with this uh, inconvenience, but let me share one more time. One more time. I think we already did. Agreement and disagreement. Let's see, 3.6, this is your pronunciation. Okay, order in the mail. Okay, almost, almost on number four. Okay, and this is what we just saw. From here, starts your evaluations. By the way, you're supposed to complete this um, throughout the weekend, right? And next week, practically, is going to be our last week of this module. Very quick, very fast. It's incredible how um, time passes by so quick. OK. Okay, so unit four, this is lesson four already. Here we're supposed to learn vocabulary related to geography. Are you good at geography, guys? Do you remember that class? Did you see that class at school or no? So, so, teacher. So, so, <laughs> really? <laughs> we're gonna have to remember a little bit about geography. Uh, with this topic we're going to study right now. Uh, first, we're going to study vocabulary this video for you. Vocabulary repeated as many times as needed. Vocabulary repeated as many times as needed. Are you ready to learn your words? Listen first and then repeat each word. Beach. Desert. Forest, hill, island, lake, river, valley, volcano, waterfall. Okay, so we're going to repeat this new vocabulary now. Welcome to one more. Okay, I just posted a picture of this image on the WhatsApp chat. Maybe you can see it better there, okay? Because I know it's not really good visible. So. Repeat, guys. Beach. 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 Repeat. Desert. 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 Forest. 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 This is new vocabulary, okay? So it's important for you to get the pronunciation and the right spelling, okay? So forest, repeat forest. 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 Repeat hill. 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 Repeat island. 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 Note that the letter S is silent. Okay? You say island. 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 Okay. No sound. You don't pronounce the letter S. Okay. The letter S no sound. Si la escribimos. Yes, you write it, but you don't pronounce it. Okay. Um. Repeat. Lake. 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 Mountain. 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 Ocean. 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 River. 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 Valley. 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 
Body. Body. Volcano. 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 Waterfall. 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 Repeat. Waterfall. Waterfall. Volcano. Volcano. Valley. Valley. River. River. Ocean. Ocean. Mountain. 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 Lake. Lake. Island. 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 Hill. Hill. Forest. 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 Desert. 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 Beach. 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 Okay, you guys have any question uh, about this converse, this uh, vocabulary? I'm sorry. Water what is waterfall? Waterfall. Waterfall. When the water, the water goes in the river, whoa, and then goes down. That's a waterfall. That's good. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's good. What else? What is hill? Hill. Similar to, it's a smaller than a mountain. Como una colina. Colina. Hill. Mm. Forest. What is forest? Bosque. Bosque. Desert. What is desert? Desierto. Okay. Bless you. <laughs> what is island? Island. Isla, okay. What is Isla. valley? Valle. Valle, okay. What is Valle ocean? De las hamacas. <laughs> what is ocean? Ocean. Ocean. Okay. And how about volcano? Volcano. 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 Okay. Letter A. Letter A. Let me see. Jaime, can you help me with the letter A? Pronunciation and spelling. Eh, desde la primera just the number one just the first one letter A ok B E A C H pronunciation beach 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 ok beach. very good thank you beach ok what's the plural what's the plural for beach beaches 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 for example, El Salvador has beautiful beaches. Beaches. Yes? yes. All right. Let's see, Miss Mercy. Go with letter B, please. Spelling and B pronunciation. B-E-S-E-R-T. Desert. 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 <laughs> it's confusing. Yes, it's confusing because desert, con las dos S's, right? Double S, es postre. So, dessert is different than desert. Desert. This is desert. All right? Good job. Take notes of the corrections. Let's go with Ms. Gilma. Letter C, please. Desert. F O R E S. C, forest. forest, which means bosque, right? Let's go with Miss Maria Siguenza. Yours, it's letter D. Ahorita, ahorita te H, I, L, L. Pronunciation? H, ah, hill. 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 The singular form will be a hill. A hill. hill. What is the plural form? Hills. 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 Like, Hills. like Beverly Hills. Have you heard that? Beverly Hills? It's a yes, very I famous. <laughs> okay. Let's go with Noah. Yours is letter E. I S L L M D. L A N D. Pronunciation? Isla. 
I'm sorry, what's the pronunciation, Noah? Island. Island. Repeat. Island. Island. Correct. All right. Thank you, Noah. Let's go with Susu. Yours is letter F. L A K. 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 A like cake. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> lake. That's right. Pronunciation. Lake. lake. Okay. Nice. 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 Thank you. Let's go with a difficult one for Mr. Rodolfo. Can you hear me, Rodolfo? Cruz. Yes. Letter G. Yes, sir. M O U N T A I N. Mountain. Mountain. Correct. Mountain. To rock and roll, Rodolfo. Let's go with Hector, letter H, please. Missing in action, Susana Carolina. Yes. Yours is gonna be letter H, please. Okay. <laughs> Eight. Yes. Oh. I can know it. It's difficult, huh? Okay. Need some help? Carla Merino, can you help her, please? Letter H. H. Yes. E. I can. Can't see? Yes. Okay. O. C. E. Oh my God, I couldn't see. Sorry to make it so difficult. Yeah, it's O C E A N. What's the pronunciation, class? Ocean. Ocean. O, open your mouth. O. o ocean. Very well. Ocean. ocean. Okay, Brian, can you help us with the next letter? That's letter I. Can you? R I B E R R River River B E R Okay River Thank you so much Brian you did great How about Jaime Reyes can you move on with letter J is B A R L E J Y Y Pronunciation Bali, Bali, why? Bali, Bali. All Bali. right, thank you, sir. Let's go with Isa. Letter K, please. Okay, uh, B O L C A N O, volcano. Fantastic, volcano. Okay. Mm -hmm. Volcano. And let's finalize that with Carla Marino. Last but not least, letter L, please. L. W I. Ah. Ah, no sé si puede acercar un poquito. Ay, acercar un poquito que casi me cuesta ver. I, I can't. Can't. Letter. I can't. I can't. It's a video. <laughs> <laughs> hey, did you see the WhatsApp picture? I posted the picture on the WhatsApp. WhatsApp, yes, in your cell phone. I, I can see in WhatsApp. Okay, thank you. Can you try, Carlo? Okay, W-A-T-E-R-F-A-L-L, -L, waterfall. Waterfall, fantastic, you guys rock and roll. Keep the pronunciation for the last time. Let's go, waterfall, repeat, waterfall. 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 Volcano. Volcano. Valley. 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 River. River. Ocean. 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 Mountain. 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 Lake. 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 Island. 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 Let me see. Hill. 
Hill. Forest. 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 Desert. 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 Beach. 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 Okay, Mercy, this is your number, Mercy? Yes, teacher. Okay, okay, okay. Let me picture it. Let me picture it. Thank Somebody you. else is not in the in the chat. Um, we gotta be in the chat. Somebody else besides Mercy? No, right? Okay, cool. Let's move on. Okay, we're gonna talk about comparisons. We're gonna talk about adjectives. We're gonna talk about comparisons, making um, using superlatives as well. Pretty, pretty interesting. Let's check this out. Hi guys, in the conversation we're about to listen, remember how to compare? Stay around for the explanation. It is important to practice and understand the conversation. Listen and practice. Here's a geography quiz in the paper. Oh, I love geography. Ask me the questions. Sure, first question. Which country is larger, China? Than China. Okay, next. What's the longest river in the Americas? Hmm, I think it's the Mississippi. Here's a hard one. Which country is more crowded, Monaco or Singapore? I'm not sure. I think Monaco is more crowded. Okay, one more. Which South American capital city is the highest? La Paz, Quito, or Bogota? Oh, that's easy. Bogota is the highest. All right. There we have a conversation based Important on to geography practice facts. and understand the conversation. <laughs> oh, Maybe I this love topic geography. Was back in the day, but this is just for practicing purposes. See? We have a conversation between Wendy and Mike, okay? Let's repeat after me. Please repeat after me. Let's go. Here's a geography quiz in the paper. Here's a Here's a geography quiz in the paper. Geography quiz in the paper. Repeat geography. Geography. Repeat. Oh, I love geography. Oh, I love geography. Ask me the questions. Ask me the questions. Sure. First question. Sure. 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 Which country is larger? China is or larger. Canada? China, China or Canada? Canada. Canada? Guys, note, note the contrast in the question. Allow me to finish and then you repeat. Which country is larger? China or Canada? Repeat. Which country is larger or Canada? China or Canada? Or Canada? That's the contrast. Okay. Repeat. I know. I know. I know. Canada is larger than China. 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 Larger. 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 It's not large. It's larger. larger. Okay. Larger. Repeat. Okay. okay. Next. Next. Okay. Next. What's the longest, longest river in the Americas? Okay. What's what? the longest river in, in the Americas? America. America. Mm. America. I think it's the Mississippi. I think, I think, I think, think the Mississippi. Here's a hard one. Here's a hard one. A hard. Which country is more crowded, Monaco Which, or Singapore? Which, Which country is more crowded, crowded. Monaco or Singapore? Monaco. Repeat, crowded. 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 You can say crowded. 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 Many people. Crowded. Bunch of people, right? Too many people. Okay. One more. Which South American capital city is the highest? La Paz, Quito, or Bogota? Repeat. 
Okay. 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 We, one, more. one more. Which, which so South America is the highest? The Bas, Ito, or Bogota? Oh, that's easy. Bogota is the highest. Oh, oh, that's easy. Is so the highest. 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 Let's practice the conversation. All the gentlemen are going to be Mikey, okay? And all the ladies, all the women are going to interpret Wendy's role. You ready? Yes, yes. are we? Yes. Gentlemen, yes. you start on three, two, one. Let's go. Here's a geography. Who is in the paper? Paper. Oh, I hello, 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 hello. Hello. Ask me the question. Sure. 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 First, first question. question. First question. Which, Which country, country is larger? Is larger? China, 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 Canada, or Canada? I know. I know. Canada is larger than China. 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 Okay. okay, next, next. what's the longest, what's the longest river, river in the Americas? In the Americas? Mm, I, I think, think it's, it's the Mississippi. Mississippi. Here's a mm. hard one. Hard one. It's a hard Which one. country, country is, is, more more crowded? is more crowded? Monaco, Monaco, Monaco or Singapore? I am um, not, I'm not, not sure. sure. I, I think, think Monaco is more crowded. 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 Okay. Okay. One okay. more. One more. One more. Which South, South American, American capital, capital, South American city capital city is the city highest? Is the highest. La Paz, La Paz, Quito, Quito, or Bogota. Or Bogota. Or Bogota. Oh, oh, that's Bogota. 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 Bogota is the highest. The highest. 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 Not high. Highest. Not high, but the highest. Do you have any question on this conversation? Questions, questions. Crowded is cruzadas. Tiene más cruces. No. Crowded es poblado. Es lleno de gente. Es como mucha gente. Muy poblado de personas. Crowded. Crowd, solo crowd es una multitud. Okay, crowded is pobladísimo, muy poblado. Questions? Teacher. Yes. This topic is uh, use the adjective comparative. That is correct, Noé. That is correct. Aquí entramos with entrance in the comparisons, comparative and superlatives. So it's very important you know adjectives. Same way that you know adverbs or verbs, you have to know adjectives. I suggest to go on Google and Google it, right? A list of adjectives, the most common adjectives. So you can study. Let's analyze, let's identify the adjectives in this conversation. Can you tell me one adjective that you can see in this conversation? Larger? Large. Lar Actually, the adjective is large. 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 Repeat, large. 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 The large. comparative large. is? Larger. 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 And the superlative is? Largest. 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 Así como ustedes se aprendían, ok, switch in Spanish, ok. Así como ustedes se aprendían en la lista de verbos cuando estaban en básico, ¿verdad? Be, was, where, been, go, went, gone. Así, los adjectives. Large, larger, largest. Entonces, primero es el adjective, luego es el comparative, and then is the superlative. Can you mention another adjective for me from this conversation? Long. 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 The adjective is? Long. Longer. Long. Yes. L-O-N-G. What is the comparative? Longer. 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 Longest. And the superlative? Longest. 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 
very well. Okay. Teacher, yes. Teacher, I can see the difference uh, the system determination, como digo, termina, eh, determination. Determination, the word in comparative eh, termination in er and superlative is eh, sp. Correct. That is a good catch. That is a good observation, no eh? The comparatives finish with ER. Finish, the comparative correct. finish with ER. And the superlative finishes with EST. Yes? That is a good observation. Ahora, estos adjetivos que acabamos de mencionar son de cuántas sílabas? Por ejemplo, long, ¿de cuántas sílabas es? One. It's only one syllable. Entonces, aquí cumple la regla, ¿ok? No es que ER and EST, porque es solo una sílaba. Por ejemplo, short. Short, it's one syllable. ¿Ok? What is the comparative? Shorter. Shorter. What is the superlative? Shortest. 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 Porque es solo one syllable. Ok. For example, tall. What is tall? Taller. Alto. Taller. Alto. Para decir más alto. Taller. No, comparando. Taller. Más alto. Taller. 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 Con e r i r Taller. Y Taller. altísimo, el más alto de todos. Tallest. 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 Again, this is one syllable. Okay. Problem is, problem is, when the adjective has two, three, or more syllables. Okay. If that's the case, okay. for example, This adjective. Dangerous. Can you pronounce? Dangerous. 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 Repeat. Dangerous. 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 How many Dangerous. syllables does it have? How many syllables does it have? Three. Three syllables. Three. And this, aquí ya no entra ER, ya no entra EST. Okay? More. Correct. More. For the comparative, vamos a ponerle more dangerous. And for more the superlative? Most. Yes. The, the most. most. The most. The most dangerous. Most. The most dangerous. Dangerous. Sí. El día de mañana les voy a mandar un link en el WhatsApp, right? Para que puedan practicar uh, these rules that can be a little challenging. All right? Thank you, teacher. My pleasure. Okay, here we have more information about comparisons with adjectives, comparatives and superlatives. Hello and welcome back. Remember there are different types of adjectives? That's right. We have short adjectives, long adjectives and irregular adjectives. With that in mind, now we'll study the superlative of adjectives. Please, that's right. We have short adjectives. This is something I just mentioned. We have short adjectives. Short adjectives. One syllable, right? And we have long adjectives. Yes? yes. For example, interesting. It's a long adjective. Okay? For example, Beautiful. Beautiful. It's a long adjective versus short adjectives like cold. It's one syllable. Or big. It's one syllable. Okay. So remember, we have short adjectives, we have long adjectives. But in number three, we have irregular. Long adjectives and irregular adjectives. 
We have irregular adjectives also. So that's important to remember. Short adjectives, long adjectives, and irregular adjectives. With that in mind, now we'll study the superlative of adjectives. Please stay around and pay attention to the explanation as well as the audio program. Comparisons with adjectives. Which country is larger? Okay, check it out. We have the adjective itself. For example, long, right? Long. Um, let me see. Can you spell long for me, guys? Can you spell it out? L-O-N-G. L-O-N-G. It's, it's a short <laughs> adjective or long adjective? It's a short adjective. It's a short adjective, so to make it comparative, we're going to put E-R. Now, it's not long, it's longer. 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 Repeat, longer. 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 And to make it superlative, we're going to put E-S-T. Additionally, additionally, para el superlative, vamos a usar un artículo, un article. Ya se fijaron que article usamos para el superlative. D. 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 Correct. Porque vamos a decir el más, right? El más. Superlative. The longest. Longest. Vaya, vamos en el caso de dry, los adjetivos que terminan con consonante y con Y, right? Consonant and Y, for example, dry. We're going to drop the Y and we're going to put I E R. Dryer. Okay? Dryer. Dryer. And to make a superlative, again, we drop the Y, we put I-E-S-T, the driest. Driest. Esa es una regla, okay? Next rule, big. Big es otra de las reglas, porque cumple la, la regla de consonant, vowel, consonant. ¿Sí? CVC, la regla del CVC. Consonant, vowel, consonant, uh, duplicamos. We duplicate the last consonant, en este caso G, y ponemos otra vez ER to make it comparative. Bigger. Bigger. And the biggest. Bigger. Okay. Now, let's go with the, with, um, with uh, long adjectives. For example, famous. 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 famous, yes, no. two syllables, it's a long adjective, entonces ahí ya no ponemos ER, sino more, y el adjetivo tal cual, more famous, more famous, en superlative, the most, the most famous. Most famous. More famous, voy a comparar, por ejemplo, Cristiano Ronaldo is more famous than Lionel Messi. Comparing, estoy comparando. Pero si digo superando, superlative, the most famous is Maradona. Yeah, Maradona is the most famous. No, teacher, is right. Kim Pelé. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Kim Pelé could be. All right. Now, other example of a long adjective, beautiful. 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 No le vamos a poner ER. No, it's a long adjective more beautiful comparative and oh. the most beautiful superlative. Most beautiful. Y tenemos ejemplos de irregular adjectives. ¿Cuáles son los irregular adjectives? Los que su comparativo es propio, right? Y su superlativo es propio. Por ejemplo, good. Good es, tiene su propio comparativo. Better. Better. And the superlative is the best. The best. Yes. Bad. Worse. The comparative is worse. Estos son irregulares. Esto no les ponemos ER. No, 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 no. Tienen su propio, ¿verdad? And the worst. The worst. Guys, yes. Uh, how many is example? Uh, que tiene su propio comparativo. Hmm. There is a bunch of information right there. 
Ahí solo les están dando como una foto porque ahí hay bastante información. Van en el orden eh, que acabamos de ver, ¿verdad? Short adjectives, estos primeros, right? Long adjectives, estos de acá en medio, y irregular adjectives. Para expandir su conocimiento, chicos, en su tiempo libre pueden irse a, a Mr. Google, St. Google, right? Y comiencen ahí con una lista de short adjectives. La descargan para su conocimiento, right? Eh, busquen right. otra de long adjectives para que les dé una lista de long adjectives. Y otra súper importante que es la de irregular adjectives. Eh, háganlo, búsquenlos, right? Yo también voy a tratar de compartirles information related to this. Right, teacher. Este es un tema bien complejo, right? It's very complex. It's not easy. It's not easy. So it's important you dedicate time. Uh, for this topic. We don't have more time, by the way. It's 10 p.m. Guys, happy weekend. Happy Friday. Happy Saturday happy and Sunday. Thank I'll you. see you. See you. Monday. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Happy Thank weekend, you. everyone. Thank you. Thank you. Be safe. See you. See you. Monday. See you. Monday. Take it easy. Monday. <laughs>